Recently I saw this video on YouTube that was two monkeys boxing and my first thought was this is genius and my second thought was now I would like to be punched in the face. So that's why I've decided to watch another episode of The Button, America's favorite show. They made a video called Gen Z Singles Reject Each Other and I thought this was fun because I'm Gen Z and one thing I know about my fellow Gen Zers is that we all suck at talking to people. Like we're just the worst. We've gotten so used to talking to people on Snapchat and Instagram and Tinder and Bumble and Farmers Only that we don't know how to verbally communicate with people. All that to say that this video caught my eye and I was interested to see how bad Gen Z people were at talking to each other. So I, I'm, I'm gonna watch it. I'm gonna watch it. What's your name? I'm Tyler. How are you? What's your name? My name's Katie. So Hi, Tyler Katie. and nice Katie. To meet you. Nice to meet you. All right, initial reactions. Are you attracted to each other? Not quite yet. He didn't even hesitate. He just went straight into it. He said, not quite yet. Her chance, Maybe exquisitely soon, I will be fond of you. Oh, I just met you like 30 seconds. Oh, you don't go off looks? Yeah, yeah. Mm, yeah. That's nice. I really like your like freckles. How many oh, freckles does he actually yeah, have? It doesn't seem like freckles. a lot. Oh. I can't tell, but it really, it doesn't, it looks like two. I think he has like two or three or four. I can't, maybe this video is bad. He might actually have more. But also, and I don't mean this in a mean way at all. I really don't. So if you take it as a mean way, that's your fault. But Tyler, he kind of looks like Rumpelstiltskin from Shrek Forever After. Tyler oh. does improv theater. Oh, improv. you do? <laughs> that's She's so cool. She's very excited about that. Yeah, every Wednesday night. Can you do some improv? Wednesday night improv. I do improv on Wednesdays. Right, right now? Yeah, let's do it together. Exercise. Okay. We're gonna go and to the park today. Yes, and we're probably gonna swing on the swings, right? Yes, and swing and then fall off. This is really lame. Clumsy. And then we're gonna do some hard drugs, right? Wow, the button really just is, he's a fiend. But first off, the button wasn't even invited to that little improv sesh. And second off, why is that where the button went? Immediately to hard drugs. Sounds like he needs a talking to. But also that was the lamest improv ever. Why couldn't they have included anything fun like dragons or lions or koala bears? Literally anything would have made that better. Go for it. I'm so sorry. You are so wow. nice and I will come to your improv. Yeah, do it. Okay. You should totally do it. Wow. I totally will. Well, Tyler is really nice. I will say that. That's cool. She's probably not going to show up, but it's cool. Tyler is sweet. You missed out. I rate this interaction a 7 out of 10. Pretty good so far. It wasn't too awkward, but there wasn't really anything interesting going on. So that is why I have deemed it a 7 out of 10. Hi. Hi, what's your name? My name's Katie. What's Katie. your name? Khalif. Khalif. Katie and Khalif. Is it bright in here, Khalif? Yeah, why are you wearing sunglasses? Uh, no, I feel like, listen, uh, it's part of the outfit. Like the uh, glasses kind of match the shirt, which match, like contrasts with the outer shirt. And it's like a, Did he just say outer shirt? Outer shirt, inner shirt, leaves room for a middle shirt, as, as they always say. But also, I do like the fit. It's a good looking fit. It makes sense. I can respect that he has to have glasses to go along with that, even though it looks like he might uh, be hiding his eyes for no particular reason, just just cause. A little bit. It all goes together. I model on the side for a little bit. Ooh. A little side model. I like it. You might have to teach me cause I'm not that good at fashion. I mean like, I can feel it. Have you ever dated a model before? I've never dated a model before. Do you only go for models? Um, not particularly. Not particularly models. I go for non-models as well. How old are you? Fun fact oh, about it, it has to be red. Oh. <laughs> that is so embarrassing. That is literally the most awkward thing ever. He pressed the button before it turned red. I would die if that happened to me. I would grow wings and literally jump out the window. It oh. has to be red. But also, I feel like the people would have explained the rules of this to him beforehand. And if not, I feel like he would have watched the button before he went on it. But maybe he didn't. I just I feel like he should have known that the button has to turn red first, but he didn't. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, okay. there he goes. He pressed it. We knew he was going to. He pressed it on time this time. So congratulations, Khalif, for not messing it up. Well, you did mess it up, but but not this time. I rate this date to zero out of ten because he pressed the button early, and that is awkward and scary and cringe. Hello. Is it Oh, my name's Sierra. Ooh, I like her Sierra. hair. I'm Khalif. Nice to meet you. Good to meet you. Is that blue? I have an interesting gray? fact about Sierra. Oh. Sierra goes through two pairs of socks a day. Uh, I don't know if that's an interesting fact. I don't know if someone tells me they go through two pairs of socks a day and I'm like, that's pretty interesting. 
I'm interested in your sock habits. Not your feet though. Don't don't get it don't get it confused. Halfway through the day, it's like new pair. Okay. My hands mm. get sweaty like crazy. Mm. And like my face gets sweaty, but like I like that interaction. I get sweaty too. I'm a sweater. See? Sweat. Super sweaty. What kind of person do you usually look for? I like people who are very kind of confident in who they are. It, it feels like you kind of, you're feeling yourself. I don't know if I agree okay. with that, but That's sure. That's cool. Are you each other's type? Um, I have a lot of types. He didn't answer the question. He just said he has a lot of types. Is she one of them? I don't know. I, all I know is he has a lot of types. My type is people that look like my celebrity crushes at the moment. Mm. Who's your celebrity crush? Like Alex Wolf. Mm. Does he look like Alex Wolf? I don't even know who Alex Wolf is. I have to look that up. Alex Wolf. Okay, so this is Alex Wolf. Does Khalif look like Alex Wolf? I'm gonna go with no. You know who he kind of looks like? And I don't know if I'm gonna say his name right, but Rami Malik, I think is his name. That's who Khalif kind of looks like. Tell me I'm wrong. I might be, but he kind of looks like him. No, but yeah, that's okay. That. Yeah, yeah, okay. okay. There's probably another celebrity that you look like. Okay. I just can't think of it right now. And you press the button. Why? Um, oh, oh. Why? Oh, oh, oh yeah. Oh, oh no. that was awkward. Yeah, yeah, that was that was a little, little, little awkward. Wow, okay. I rate that one a six out of 10. The conversation was going pretty well, but the end there was a little, a little awkward. It's a little weird. I kind of felt threatened by it a little bit. Hi. Hi. What's your name? Izzy. Izzy, Izzy. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So what do you do for work? work. I am in tech. What tech? Do do? I thought he was a model, or did he do modeling on the side? He's a tech guy who does modeling on the side. A, a tech model. I was, um, yeah. Anyways. Isabel has four cats. Four cats. One of them isn't mine, it's my roommate's, but yes, I was given a cat by my... Okay, hold on, hold on. A lot, a lot just happened here. First off, Button said she has four cats, and then she was like, No, I don't. My roommate just gave me a cat. One of them isn't mine. It's okay. my roommate's. But yes, I was given a cat by my... Which means you have four cats. The cat is yours. Your roommate gave it to you. Three plus one equals four. She also pressed the button, but I'm more interested in the cat thing. It's your cat, okay? It's, it's yours. Your cat. I rate this one, and this is gonna be controversial. I feel like it's gonna be very controversial, but I'm rating this one one out of 10 because nothing is as bad as when Khalif pressed the button early, but also I feel like this conversation was nothing. It was a big old nothing conversation. And she said that cat was her roommate's even though it's hers now. So it lost a few points. Don't at me. Hi. Hello. All right. What's your name? My name's what's Izzy, what's your name? Izzy, Brendan. Nice to meet Izzy. you. Yeah, Brendan. Brendan. Yeah. Are you Italian? I am Italian. Oh, what was the tattoo? How did you know she, he was Italian? Does he have an Italian looking arm? Fun fact about Brendan, his hands are always clammy and sweaty. Mm, that is fun. I love hearing about people's clammy and sweating hands. Very fun. <laughs> they are sweaty. Yeah. <laughs> See how you pulled that? I don't mind. They it's seem just, like they're having fun. I don't know, texture's a thing for me. Oh, but for sure. I don't really mind. My feet get clammy. What did she say about feet? I heard something about feet. Texture is a thing for me. Oh, but for sure. I don't really mind. My feet get clean. Oh, she was just gonna say something about her feet and then it never happened. Also, we pressed the button. It's coming. <laughs> ah, sorry, it was nice to meet you. Ah, that's how he laughed. Ah, that's cool. It's kind of like Seth Rogen. I'm just not very physically attracted, I'm sorry. That's okay, thank you. Yeah, for sure. I'll give it a five out of 10. It was kind of a normal conversation. They were kind of vibing. So, I mean, you know, five out of 10. Hello, good. chillin', what about you? I'm Brendan. Brendan Anna, nice to meet you. Brendan and Anna. I like your overalls. Anna. Thank you, my roommate told me not to wear this, but. Really? Yeah. And you defied your roommate. I feel like you should have listened to your roommate. Why did you wear that? The fit itself isn't bad, I just feel like for this, it is not the vibe. Call me crazy, but I feel like you need to go bail some hay or something. I don't know, I don't know. I don't know. Fun fact about Anna, she always puts her friends before you. Okay, but these fun facts aren't fun. They're just facts. They're normal facts. They are definitionally facts. Okay. That's not a red flag for you? No, if anything. It's, it's, not, it's not a red flag to you. It's not a red flag. Because it should be red flag, blah, 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 blah. I could see you two together. <laughs> Thank you. Her hair kind of matches his shirt. Kind of interesting. That's a future thinking button. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Wow. She laughed at that. He said that's future thinking and then she went, no, it's not. It's not future thinking because I'm canceling you. Why? 
There's actually there's someone else out there that I think you would really vibe with. She, okay. she didn't answer why. I rate this one seven out of ten because the conversation felt pretty natural. Hi! I literally was just eating granola bar. <laughs> <laughs> Why should someone date you? She kind of looks like uh, a librarian mm -hmm. a little bit. <laughs> That's a really hard They're question. Fun. What are your hobbies? Like, what is? Um, if you had to describe in, yourself in like three. I'm an like, English major in school, so I'm always. Oh, you're still that makes sense. She's an English major. She looks like it. She looks like she'd be an English major. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the dress or the the sweater or the glasses. She just she just exudes librarian slash English major. And that's not an insult. It just that's what she looks like. What year? I'm a senior. Are you? Okay. You graduated? Or? I did graduate. Oh, yeah. what was your major? Art. <laughs> oh, okay. Art, 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 art. She laughed because she knew she's never gonna get a job. Just kidding. I'm sure there's a job out there. I just don't know. I don't. I don't know what the job would be. An art teacher. It's kind of like a pyramid scheme. Like you become an art teacher just to teach art to other people, who then become art teachers to teach art to other people, and it just goes on forever. It could have been something else. I'm not. It could have been. No, I, I don't regret my major. With, like, the I'm, so, I'm so sorry. It's okay. It's okay. It was bound to happen. All right. It I'm was bound to happen. That's funny, I like that. I give this one an eight out of 10 because it was very natural, felt like they were vibing, just nice, clean, safe, enjoyable. I don't know why I use those adjectives, but I use them and I'm gonna stick by them. But that's what the conversation was. So eight out of 10. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm Jasper. Jasper. Jasper, nice to meet you. Oh, that's a cool name. Has she never heard the name Jasper before? Is this her first time hearing that name? Like Casper, with, but with a J. Your name? Anna. Ooh, tattoos. Uh -huh, yeah. Why did he say it like that? Ooh, tattoos. Uh -huh, yeah. Mmm, tattoos. Yummy. I like eating tattoos. That's what he said. I he I just repeated what he said. <laughs> I don't have any, but I really want one. Really? Yep. Okay, Can't decide. What would you get? This is really random. Okay. A butterfly eating a cheeser. That is really. I love random. it. Let's go after this. Heck yeah! All right, she's into him. She is. She's clearly into him. In like two seconds, she's into him. She wants to get a butterfly eating a cheeseburger tattoo. Yeah. Heck yeah! Yeah, that sounds great to me. <laughs> Second date, pay for your first tattoo. Do you want to see a magic trick? Yes. You. <laughs> I didn't hear what she said, but why did she show that? Also, it's not that you. I kind of just overreacted. But why did she? What made her say that? Show that. Do you want to see a magic trick? Yes. Oh, she called it a magic trick. Why? Why would? Why did she think that was anything? Why? Is that how she flirts? Because I don't. I don't like that. I and mean, there's nothing wrong with her teeth doing that. But it's just the fact that she said, "Want to see a magic trick," and then did it. I, I just. I don't. It's. Uh, uh, uh. Gen Z, it's Gen Z. I can do the warm if you want. I can do the warm too. Wait, actually? Yeah. Okay, she's too excited about that. She is too excited about him knowing how to do the worm. Like, you know she has a crush on him because she's super interested in whatever he says. It's the worm. Okay, it's not solving world hunger. It's better than that. I think so. I haven't- Listen, get in here. Why did she do that? Why did she do that? I have a friend out there. Her name is Jade, she's awesome. We can both do the worm. Okay. We're looking for other wormers. And we're gonna start a troop. We're gonna collectively. Right, this conversation is getting a little, a little cringe. Are you into each other? Do you see each other? Are they into second each other? Day? I am. Yeah, I could, I could see that. We can practice I worm. could see it too. I could see that she was into you. She made it very obvious and kind of cringe, but that's okay. Why are you into her? I think that we're just vibing, you know? Since the second that I walked in, it was, you know, it was the hello. Hello. It was the eye contact. Oh. That's a big part of it, too. That is true. Yeah. You two would be a really cute couple. I can see this. Oh, they gosh. did it. They won. <laughs> if I could blush, I would. <laughs> they won the button. I rate that one 9 out of 10 because they were having a very natural conversation. They, they vibed very well, even though it was a little bit cringe. But they vibed very well. They won. That felt like a good conversation. So 9 out of 10. And honestly, that wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. Gen Z did a little bit better than I expected. My average rating for all of the dates was 5.73. Five, so it's not super high, but that's also because Khalif brought it way down when he pressed the button too early. So blame Khalif. He shouldn't have pressed the button that early. He just shouldn't have. And actually, that's a little bit better than I thought they were gonna do. I thought it was gonna be like a 1.2, but it was, it was better. But overall, according to my ratings, Gen Z still is not very good at dating. So we should just stick to Snapchat and Instagram and Fortnite.